Hello, and welcome to another edition of Art of Arlo Moon. So, on today's piece, um, it's Secretary, famous uh, horse. I wanted to do, initially, I was like, you know what, I, I always do his portraits. Um, which I have fun doing, actually. Um, but I'm like, you know, something a little different, maybe a horse piece. I was looking up uh, horse racing, and um, I just wanted, I saw this image, and I saw, I was like, okay, that's the image I want to draw. And I don't know what the science behind that is. There is no science, as far as I can tell. Um, it's just like a feeling. I'm going to use purple again. We're going to mix it together, because I don't want exactly the same HUs every time. And this is kind of the same style, I guess, but... Um, it's, I'm working on this style for a little bit. We'll see how long it, how long it lasts or whatever. But um, just kind of mix everything together, and so I don't get the exact same thing. I'm be bored and make it look boring, but um, just different things. But um, you get the idea basically. But I don't know any kind of history or anything about it. I just thought that image was a really good image, and it would be a little different because it's. Um, you know, an image of somebody else other than port well, an animal or something else other than just a portrait. So, um, I generally did the long, the same thing for a long time, and I, I like really like doing it. So, um, but then on the other hand, I don't want it to be. I just mix it up as nice, you know. It's a little bit different sometimes. Um, so I'm gonna mix some different HUs together, which is not that much of a change, I realize, but. Um, doesn't have to be extremely different. I mean, the last Dylan I was just doing, um, or that I did, or whatever, um, it was kind of a different thing. I mean, I think the variances are important, but it doesn't have to be extreme difference. I mean, I do different things. I'll do spray painting or whatever, but um, it's just, you know, you want to mix up some of it. And um, so, I don't know, I haven't got the hang of this down 100% as far as what the time lapse, how much it's... I'm going to mix all these colors together, apparently. Um, because I still am aiming for a 10-minute video. I don't think there's that many people that want to sit through 20-minute videos. Um, but then on the other hand, um, I'm pretty quick, but even that... Making art, it takes a little bit of time. It's not like five seconds, you're done. Unless somebody doesn't care about watching the process, which is fine. Um, it's just one of those things that's kind of puzzling to me still. I'm still early on this process. and learned a lot, so to speak, I think. For, just saying for me, I feel like I've learned a lot in the short time I've been back on YouTube. Um, kind of got away for years off of it because I was just like, Facebook is... I can just post to Facebook, what's the difference? But a friend of mine, he gave me a computer and everything, because I, I already had, like, multiple computers that were $1,000 a piece. And, you know, they all broke. <laughs> the last one was $1,600, and it was an out-of-box special. If you ever get a computer, don't ever get an out-of-box special. I don't care if they tell you. It's, ah, uh, yeah, we checked, and it's amazing, and everything's up to par. And then you get it, you can't do anything with it. I bought a game, Age of Empires, that's, something, that's how old it is, and I was playing that obsessively, um, and I had a music program, which I played music, so I played the music most on most of these videos now, which is not really me playing the guitar or something, but I played the guitar, and um, I plan to get a better app, like a recorded on there, and possibly, which is what I really want to do, is re make a little recording studio in this room in the corner so I can just record the music um, and in a way it kind of gives me an outlet to make more make music I had with bands a hundred years ago um, but after the bands were over I kind of didn't really pursue it again I just worked and worked I worked obsessively now so say so yeah, we'll take a break here hold on but basically after but basically after the bands were over I kind of didn't really pursue that again I just started working and working and working and I still work like that now um, but basically, um, I think that would be really cool that kind of record more stuff. I play a little bit here and there, so I'll just kind of more acoustic than anything because I was, uh, you know, I'm just sitting there playing when I had a, actually a kid's acoustic guitar. It was for my son. I just would play on that. I had it behind the guitar, or behind my, uh, recliner. So I'd be sitting there and I'd play on it here and there, but I never really, uh, went back into recording 
forward to playing that much electric. And then last time I tried to play a half stack, my half stack from back in the 90s, it's actually overheating or something. It's not, it's solid state, so it really shouldn't overheat, but there's a drop in the power when you turn it on after a little bit, it warms up and then drops the power. So, some problem. And it was kind of demeaning a little bit because I went and got a string set one time and we're talking, uh, it's essentially a $50 head. So, you're like, wow, 50 bucks. It really wasn't worth much. It hasn't held any value or anything, but it doesn't matter. I just wasn't like I was buying it for so I could return and sell it or something later. Anyway, the point is, I'm going to at some point actually sit there and record music and just have some songs and from the video songs, basically. And right now, I'm using an, a, a, an Oxy, it's A U X Y app, and it is really fun. It's like digital, not, I wouldn't even say DJ music, but something towards DJ music. Um, it's really fun to sit there and manipulate. My son actually figured out how to do a little more on it. Of course, he's 10, so he's like, of course, you do it like this. And I actually don't think I'm that inept in it, but um, I hadn't discovered the rest of the features on that app. I still haven't mastered or anything. If you're going to call it mastering of an app, there is such a thing. Um, but, yeah, that's what I'm planning to do, some music different music styles and for the background music when I do time lapses and so anyway we're going a little bit closer to where I want to be you see this blue background it's all going to be deal it's roughly the same process again I'm going to do different color HUs on this one and we'll have to time lapse some more stuff because this again will take too long to put into a video you know I don't know how to properly process that into you know hey do three hours into a, a 10 minute video but I mean, I guess I would make uh, You Laugh, You Lose 65 or a million of episodes of those if I was, you know, if it had 58 million subscribers. And then that's all I would have to do and not have to work. That would be great. Thanks. I'll be back in a second. We'll do some time lapsing.
Hey, so yeah, it's the end of the video here. Um, so uh, again, I got away from uh, recording my voice over it. It might be too much or whatever. And how to time lapse that long? I don't know. Um, basically, I actually try to time lapse that. We'll see if it comes out with a thing. I don't want to make anything more than ten minutes, but it's difficult to put it in there when you're painting a painting. So. This is mixed media technically, so whatever, you can whine about it or whatever, whoever will whine about it, but even so, it takes a while still to do, um, and, uh, so there's all the different colors, I did a lot of de different detailing, I'm going to white detailing, which is kind of interesting, I think it's good, just different, a little bit different, I've done it before, it's not like I've never done it, but anyway, there's some more on that, um, so this is Secretariat again, it's the end of this video, um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it at all, if you're still in the video at this point, you probably at least tolerated it. Um, if you liked it at all, like it. Like, put the like button. It takes two seconds. Um, subscribe if you're interested. If you've seen more than one of the videos and you're interested in seeing what I make next coming up here in the future, anytime, um, subscribe, yeah. Um, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell after you subscribe so you know when I update, which I'm going to try to do every day. And otherwise, you know, other than that, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for any support you can give. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to build it up. And uh, go out and make some art today, won't you?